Hi, this is Dorothy from TaiChiBozeman.com slash RawFoodBlog and from FaithDiets.com. I'm making donut holes today, not fried, so they're good for you. And they're also vegan and gluten-free. The first thing you do is take a cup of almonds and put them through your food processor just for about a minute until it makes a fine powder. And then the rest we can do by hand. And the base, so it's a cup of almonds and a cup of dates that have been soaking, and I'm going to pour off the water just in case I need it, but if I don't, I like to put it in my smoothies. It makes them really sweet. So a cup of dates and a cup of almonds and a dash of vanilla powder, or you could use vanilla extract. And then three tablespoons of coconut. And this is all you need for the base. So I'm going to mix that together until it forms a ball. And you want to do this by hand because it keeps more of the texture in the donuts. And I know some of you are thinking, why don't I just use a tablespoon of almond butter, like I happen to say a lot in my recipes. If you, make the, if you use almond butter, it'll be truffles. And we don't want that kind of consistency. We want it more to taste like um, little cinnamon donut holes that you used to have when you were little, or maybe you just had them today. <laughs> so if you want to see the videos on truffles, you can see them. I have them on our website and on YouTube. Okay, so that's all you do to make the donut holes, and I'll show you some different variations you can do. So you can form them into little patties like that. Let me turn on another light here. There we go. I'll make three to show you the different kinds of things. Actually, at this, before you roll them into balls, you could have put in a cup of dried pineapple, which makes excellent donut holes, or a cup of dried apricots. Or you can make them chocolate or cinnamon, and I'll show you how. So these are coconut crystals with a um, teaspoon of cinnamon in it. So you could take your, you know, uh, donut hole and roll them in cinnamon sugar. It's like cinnamon sugar donuts. Or you could take your donut hole. Oops and roll them in chocolate or carob sauce. This is just one tablespoon of carob, two tablespoons of carrot, excuse me, with a couple drops of olive oil and some coconut agave, coconut syrup. You could have used honey or agave. Or you could take your donut hole and roll it in coconut. Everybody's going to love these. They're amazing. Or you can invent your own. So there's three donut holes from Dorothy at TaiChiBozeman.com slash RawFoodBlog and from FaveDiets.com.